In this lecture, we'll be learning about creating custom HTML helpers. So over here, you can see that I have this code block where I'm iterating through a given model. Now this model contains a list of competencies. So here I am giving the competency name. Now with each competency, I have got certain trainings associated. In order to find out all those trainings for a given competency, I'll be creating a HTML helper over here. Now you can see I'm just making use of the HTML dot get competency trainings and I'm passing the partial view for it and here I'm passing the competency name. So based on this name whatever trainings are there they will be rendered in this block. Now here you can see the view training manager partial and it's just looping through the list of trainings available and here I am just getting the CRM training model. Now over here what I've done is in my solution explorer you can see that I've created a directory called helpers and then I've created this file competency training helper. Now this file is a static file so here you can see the name static and this is HTML helper extensions so it has to be static class with static methods. Now the first parameter will be a reference to HTML helper itself and then I have passed the name of the view and the competency name based on that I'm just iterating through over here using the DB context I'm searching for any matching competencies and if it's there it's returned as a model and that model is then passed to the HTML dot partial method now here view is what we have passed in our get competency training custom helper and we have the model over here so this is going to render this particular model here so that way i'll be able to get the trainings associated with a given competency now let's take a look at it how it's going to look to the end user and that's how it's looking over here so we have competency name and then the associated trainings for that given competence. So using this approach you can easily create parent-child relationship and render partial views as well. 